I've lost faith that you're taking care of your citizens in good faith. That's really get it together. Take care of your people. You heard her. Thousands of people in North Carolina still can't get a hold of anyone to talk about their unemployment benefits. Tonight, CBS 17's consumer investigator Steve Sprache is getting answers about improvements to the system and why it remains such a frustrating process for so many people. Trying to get through to the Division of Employment Security Call Center remains a hit or miss proposition for many looking to get answers about their benefits. I called that number and nobody's talking to me. It just says call back later at a lower volume time. As a licensed massage and body therapist, Chrissy Vlodman was forced into unemployment when the governor's executive order shut down facilities like the one that she owns. I have a moral obligation not to kill my clients by a virus. As a self-employed person, she was only eligible for pandemic unemployment insurance. She says she applied for it when it first became available but has yet to see any money, so she applied again. Have you tried the chat by any chance? It will not download on my system and it just bogs my system down that I can't even get to my home page when that chat is trying to load. Last Sunday, the state opened a special hotline for pandemic unemployment insurance. And they had a new feature wherein you could be put in a callback queue. So I signed up and they called me back. And then she found out why she wasn't getting her benefits. My second application that had been denied for unemployment for PUA had inadvertently been slipped into traditional unemployment application as opposed to PUA and that's why I was declined the second time. Do you think anytime soon you'll be seeing any cash at all from the state? Well we just started all over again because my previous application got slipped into the wrong grouping. So no, no time soon. The state says typically you start receiving your benefits within 14 days of filing your initial claim, but with more than a million people looking for unemployment benefits here in North Carolina, these are not typical times. Working for you, I'm consumer investigator Steve Sprazier. Nice.